we want to make this a, a, a beneficial partnership and yes. we want you guys to get behind Nobbies just as much as we have and they've yeah. got behind our show. That's right. So the so, best way to help us is, yeah, how do we promote Nobbies? Send us an email at lukeandlewis5.com of yep. how you think we should promote the underwear brand and we will read out your suggestions. We will do some of the best ones, but not only that, we'll also probably do some of the worst ones for a laugh. Well, see, what I've noticed about our show is most shows would just go, we'll do the best suggestions, but because nah. our suggestions are usually so bad in our inbox, we, we are, none of them can really be described as, as best. Good. So we kind of are forced, or even good, yeah, as you we're, reckon. We're kind of forced into a weird position where we have to pick between average to to immediate, moderately yes. good. And horrendous. Horrendous, yeah. So, hence why some of the intros at the start of yep. the earlier episodes got played, the Grand yep. Theft Auto thing. Terrible. Horrible. Um, but that's often, all we had. Often a guy, um, and I'm happy to name and shame, he, shame him, uh, a guy named Chicken Imp always emails <laughs> us. Emails I reckon we us. get six emails a week. Yep. And I'll be honest, Chicken, or whatever, you, is that your first name? I don't know. Mr. Imp? Mr. Imp. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> we don't like your ideas, okay? In fact, I know that you weren't going to go this hard, but... Chicken Imp, fuck <laughs> off. Don't email us anymore because I have gotten five emails from you in the last couple of weeks. i got to be honest, I turned notifications off because I saw Chicken Imp for the fifth time with a shit idea and I'm like, you know what? Fuck everyone's idea. Chicken Imp's ruined it for all of you. Oh, oh, man, so, so Chicken funny. Imp, go away. Wow, that's brutal. I feel like now I feel like I need to read it. <laughs> Stand by it. I know that you guys think that might be a yeah, bit brutal, but, but I'm you know standing what? by it. Now we're going to get so many emails from oh. Mr. Imp this week. <laughs> <laughs> Just like, and now he's going to be like, oh, hang on, guys, here's a good one. All right, here's. No, oh, you wow. have no good ideas. Your fucking email is Chicken Imp. I'm trying to find one of his bad IDs. I mean, they're all bad. I can just... <laughs> Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, he... Okay. He, he sent 12. 12, 12. emails. Okay. <laughs> hey, <laughs> fuck off. You know what your emails are? This is what they are. Big, stinky, poo <laughs> farts. Every time I open up a chicken imp email, this is what I read. Just <laughs> shit. And it smells like shit, and it sounds like shit. It probably oh. tastes like shit. Go away. <laughs> <In this poor guy. laughs> That's your emails, mate. This poor guy listens to our podcast every <laughs> single time. And you know what? <laughs> oh, man. He, he suggested that we have a joke segment where we just tell jokes. <laughs> oh, that's so Is this the guy that sent us a joke to tell on stage? Yeah. Oh, that's right. Yeah. He sent no, us. No, don't say it. He's, I won't say the joke. He oh. sent us a joke, like a joke that he took from the internet that was mega racist, not even funny, <laughs> emailed it to us, and then went, hey, mate, I know you're going on tour soon. You can use this joke as long as you credit me. <laughs> like I would get on okay. stage and yes. be like, hey, guys, welcome to No Slide Season. <laughs> Thanks for coming out to the show. Now, first up, and then I pull out my emails. I've got a joke from Chicken Imp. Uh, I didn't then, write it. Sorry, Mr. Imp. Thank Mr. you very Imp. much for submitting. We don't take joke submissions. When no. has a comedian ever taken a joke submission? It's like my, the, every comedian's worst nightmare is you can use that if you want. No. Nah. Well, I don't want. Don't want. Especially if the person saying that hasn't even written it themselves. Yeah. Like, for all we know, he could have jacked oh, that from another comedian. It was. No, it was from, like, a, a joke website. I read yeah. the joke. It was like, yeah, what's the difference between a uh, and a... Uh, and it was really offensive. <laughs> <laughs> uh, here's an actual email we got from Chicken Imp, which kind of shows you how justified Lewis was before. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> what is... Okay, so he sent this in for, for the thoughts segment. <laughs> I can read it. <laughs> read it. Do you want me to read it? it? I'll read it. I got it, I got it. What is my purpose on this earth? Ooh. Then you guys... <laughs> then, and, and so, so that's his thought. Is What is my purpose on this earth? And then he said, Then you guys could laugh and say how dark it was. Then play the hmm sound. Sent. This is the worst part. <laughs> you ready? <laughs> if you thought... <laughs> This email. No, no, wait, 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 wait. If you thought this email. <laughs> if you thought this email couldn't get any worse, 
sent from my iPad. <laughs> Sitting there on his fucking iPad, <laughs> typing up ten emails a fucking day of the worst <laughs> ideas ever, and then go and send. Yep, the boys will love that one. <laughs> Fuck. Oh man, what were we even talking about? 